How do we start this? Shall I start or shall you start? You may start. I may start. You may start. Yeah, well, it's only fair, considering you started the first one. That is true. Right. Witcher 2, Enhanced Edition. Enhanced Edition. Insass Assassins, Assassins of, of Kings. Kings. So, plural assassins, plural kings. P plural kings. More than one assassin, more than one king, and I guess king's gonna die a bit. Yeah. So, have you played this before? I have. Have you played the first one before? I played, I played the first one a lot more than I played this one. Am I missing anything by not playing the first one? You'll be fine. Okay. You'll be fine. Because <laughs> so I played the first, like, half hour, and I was like, I'm done. <laughs> You're done with this. Yeah, no. I, like, I, got enough to, I got enough to get where this is going. Indeed. Not as more repulsive than those these, these monsters that defy nature and are known by the name of Witcher, as they are the offspring of foul sorcery and witchcraft. Unscrupulous scoundrels without conscience and virtue, they are the virt virtual creatures from hell. Something about that. And something about taking lives. Uh, anonymous roll that. Anonymous. So, good job, Anonymous. Well done. Do you ever think about how... Anonymous seems to write a lot of things, really. Yeah. Very wise person. Six years have passed since that memorable day when the Northern Kingdoms, their forces united, defeated the hosts of Nifgard in the open battle of Berna. Brina. <laughs> Berna. Berna. <laughs> Famine and disease reign all over the north. Elves and dwarves inhabit the ghettos, in ever increasing numbers, they flee to the forest to join Scoyotel units. Scoyotel. And that's thanks to the card game, I'm able to pronounce that. <laughs> in Temeria, the unidentified assassins attempt to murder King Fultest. The killer dies at the hands of Geralt Rivia, a professional monster slayer. A um, professional model. <laughs> no, he doesn't get that until Witcher 3. <laughs> A month passed this. On the banks of the Ponto River, Foltest's army is victorious once more, ending civil strife in the country. Yet the price of this triumph proves immense. To Mario, the year 1271. I like that one from old man to old school reporter. <laughs> yeah, it's probably... Oh wait, Witcher oh. 1 flashbacks. Oh yeah, yeah, definitely Witcher 1. That's Witcher 1 flashback size. <laughs> I know, because I remember. You remember these things. Come on, Sixes. Daddy needs you. Oh, shit. Ha! 20 orange to granddad. <laughs> Looky there, he's awake. That sounded very light for 20. Don't go in there! Shut it, he's in chains, can't do a thing. Am I right, Master Geralt? Damn rude. Roll again! Why? The dice didn't roll! Calling me a cheat? Take it back. Look, he's awake again. Monster slayer, my ass. A regular horson. I heard witches all start out as roadside orphans taken in by mages. Mages who experiment on them. <laughs> Folks say they plow witches come the equinox. That's how they get those spooky eyes. Enough! Take him down and put him in the interrogation room. I thought you died. I'm not so easy to kill. I don't believe we've been introduced. Vernon Roach. Oh, so you're Roach. 
Well, mate, I would shake your hand if I could. <laughs> Walk around behind me if you want to shake. Well, how foolish of me. Vess! Unshackle him. Oh, what? what Hang good, on, do you appear in Witcher 3? Good buddy. Vess. I think she does. Geralt of Rivia. Care to introduce us? No, thanks. Bring something to drink. We can't sit here cotton mouthed. What a hat, though. Yeah. You will tell me everything you remember the entire assault, and all that happened in the solo. And if I refuse? I shall have to beat you. I've commanded the special forces for a while. Got good at beating others. You're a witcher. You'd endure much. You better believe it. Worst case scenario, you'll suffer through it, go back to your cell, and tomorrow, they'll publicly gut you, skin you, and hang you. Just like that? For nothing? No. For Temeria. Downright praiseworthy. Where should I start? It was a long day. I wish to hear the important bits. Oh, actually, I remember playing this, like, or not playing, no, I remember watching like an hour worth of this. And we get we get a flashback to like a siege, don't we? Yeah. Right, so this is what we're talking about. Yes. So this doesn't really have much to do with the first one. No. Like, does Roach appear in the first one? Honestly? Don't remember. Okay. The morning, the king summoned me. Just so we're clear on this, I was not eager to go into battle. But Foltest is not someone you refuse. Dun, dun, dun. I think we see Yennefer or Triss, don't we? It's mainly Triss in this one, I think. God, do you think they would have, like, some kind of, you know, skin, well, like, filler? Look at that bite mark on your shoulder. That looks deep. Mm hmm. This is that, yeah. Now, who are you saying hmm at? Because there's... Whoa, oh, whoa, 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 okay. Whoa, whoa. Yo. I mean, I get this is an adult game, but okay, this is... Uh, oh, oh, okay. oh, Geralt. Yeah, there she is. Hey, Triss. You were in the first game. Witcher! Are you up? Oh, oh. Cover your cell, Hen. His Majesty, King of Tiberia, Pontar, Mahakam, and Sodden, Senior Protector of Bruges, summons Master Geralt to appear before him. Tell him I'll be there shortly. Sorry to intrude like this, milady, but the King. We heard you. A pleasant day to you, milady. Witcher. <laughs> Watch answer. To be fair, though, he's an infantryman. He hasn't had any in like 10 years. <laughs> to be fair, though, in medieval times, they had all sorts in the camps. They had prostitutes. They had, you know, all that business, gambling. Uh, um, mm. Uh, yeah, well, yeah. Well, you're probably more versed in that than I am, to be to be honest. Researching that Jean of Arc stuff. The Jean of Arc. They've cleared the forests. They're pillaging nearby villages, and they'll soon be murdering each other en masse. Why? Because Foltest's having a spat with the mother of his bastard twins. This is a really stupid war, Triss. Bastards or not, the children are still royal blood. The Lavalettes are an old Tumerian dynasty, and the mix is sufficient basis to vie for the crown. History has known stranger contenders. Which doesn't change the fact that... I know. Faltest and the other northern monarchs are neither the smartest nor the most refined. But they're kings, one of whom we serve. And I'll see Faltest is summoned, protect him if need be. But once the castle falls, we leave. Did you dream of the wild hunt again? 
tail drop for the third game. <laughs> I get the feeling that dream's important. Running frantically through the forest. The wild hunt. They're the last things I remember. I wake up and try to relive the dream and the memory, hoping I'll find some guidance. Some clue to grab onto. Something that'll help me recover my memory. Dreams can be very powerful. Some people claim they can even shape reality. People claim a lot of things. The problem is, it's often nonsense. We'll know in time. I'm sure of it. The scout swears he saw a dragon down by the river. Claims he ran into a Scoia'tael unit. That would have been it if the dragon hadn't swooped down. The elves apparently bowed in prayer and he escaped. A dragon? In the midst of civilization? Oh, please. Besides, does it matter? Witchers don't hunt dragons. Or has something changed? Nothing's changed. And you're right. It's probably not a dragon. Although it could be a forked tail or a slizzard. Maybe even an overgrown wyvern. The scout ran into some elves and scurried away. That's how that story begins and ends. Um, I like how there's drakes, but there's no dragons. Like, dragons are still a myth, but there's dragon-like creatures. Sure, yeah, lead yours. The unlucky assassin. How did the autopsy go? It was a nightmare. In the months since you killed him, the King's medics poked around in his corpse like a bunch of amateurs. What arrived in that cart? Well, I wouldn't even call it a corpse. Foltest has some trust issues. Did you learn anything? His pupil suggested he could probably see in the dark as well as you. I couldn't put an age on him. The killer snuck past all the guards and nearly killed Foltest and me a month ago. And now you tell me he was a witcher? Possibly. I'm just saying what the autopsy showed. I haven't told anyone, nor do I plan to. I know what it could do to you if it got out. You might be a savior, a king's witcher now, but masters can be as fickle as the cults they ride. Ah, oh, okay, so... So we're not part of the witcher group like we were in the first yeah. game. Well, we... they basically all died. Well... Right in the beginning. Well, yeah, one one guy did, and then I was like, uh, let me tell you a story of how this place was te 50 years 50 ago. 50 years ago. Ah, we, got, we got slaughtered, and I only lived because I played dead. <laughs> and that's the old bugger you've seen in the third game. Yeah. Time to go. Time to look to the lustful king and his stupid war. I'll join you later. Right, so here we are then. Here we are. Hello, Miss Marigold. Wait, there's a... Oh, distance Ooh. searching. Brilliant. I don't have to go right up to things. I can just, like, spam A. You just glance at them. Yeah. Oh, and use oh. your witcher mind powers. Right, let's just... Oh. Whoa, I go a uh, sprint. Yikes, right. Geralt's got to go. This guy's still hanging out outside here. <laughs> nah, he fucked off. There we go. Music took a I while know. to catch up there. Alright, okay. Like any long haul, uh, let's explore before we do anything. Oh. Yes, let's take a good look around. Okay, so as someone who is more schooled in medieval warfare than I. Uh, at a glance, can you tell me what's happening here? <laughs> well, there's catapults, so there's clearly a siege I going think on. I think you'll find their trebuchets. Trebuchets. <laughs> Very well. <laughs> clearly, clearly, I am not the more ah. verse. <laughs> to be fair, I had been playing, like, Rome Total War this past, this past week. <laughs> Murky waters, up your ass. Barrels of it. Yes, sir, Sergeant, sir. At ease. Now, listen up. We'll soon be joining the fray. And I must say, I've never seen a lovelier war. While the knights battle it out on the walls, we head straight for the town. But Sergeant, there's a river in the way. The very reason we've spent the last week nailing together rafts and stealing... <clears throat> that is, 
commandeering fishing boats. We shall cross the river to the town in those very boats, as planned by His Majesty, King Foltest. What say you to that, flunkies? Long live the king! Close order! March! So we're trying to get across the river. That's not marching, that's just... that's just walking. <laughs> yeah, that's just a casual stroll. Yeah, is that, can I go in here? No. I can, wow, the controls are like a little too sharp. That's something to get used to. Cheer up, Witcher! Cheer up, Witcher! There's a war going on! <laughs> we might all die today! Your presence insults the gods. They'll turn away from us in battle. Well, fuck, fuck you, buddy. Rick. Don't all disperse in search of booty and wenches. Eliminate the stragglers first. Kick their asses, Geralt! If it goes on like this, we'll be sipping wine in the Lovelet's chambers by sundown. Too true. Overwhelming force. That's what we are. <laughs> They're getting what they deserve. I hate traitors. At your service. At your service. Oh, 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 guy. Guy. Hey. Hey. Not wearing very conspicuous uh, outfits, are they? What's that? What? Not wearing very conspicuous outfits. Well, they're like infantrymen, so they have to they have to wear the house colors. <laughs> Naturally. Naturally. I mean, how else are you supposed to identify your troops when you're going to get them into friendly fire? But you should at least fire? cover it with a healthy coating of mud. <laughs> oh, looky there, new boy! It's that witcher. Geralt of Rivia ought to know about amulets. Witcher, sir, I have a question for you. Behind you. Oh, new boy. Hey, new boy. Hey, new boy. We know each other. Don't recognize your old mates. We're the Crinfrid Reavers. I lost my memory. As did Boholt. After the hunt for the Golden Dragon, he took a spill and hit his head on a rock. He can still be a beast in battle, but besides that, he don't do much save eating shit. Rarely even lusts after women. I doubt that's amnesia. I'm Kenneth, and this one here they call Desperate, and this is New Boy. He's um, apprenticing with us, like. I haven't had much luck with the monsters of late, so we enlisted. Now New Boy's gotten itself into this wager situation. Would you help us for old time's sake? I mean, we all got a little rile. But those are bygones, as I see it. We'd have set you free. The sorceress, too. Boholt was just fooling about the uh, raping and all. Do do I ask the question? <laughs> well, get that sweet lore, I guess. What rape? Shut your trap, Desbrit. The Witcher don't remember. Waste of words to remind him. We're old mates. That's that. So you'd have raped this old mate? Just the sorceress. You were there to kill the dragon. You talking about Triss? The peasants wanted at it, everyone did. But mm -hmm. mm. we argued, there was some commotion, a regular rumble in fact. We tied you up like hogs, meaning you and the sorceress, and went after the beast. But the dragon thrashed us so hard, we spent the next half year licking our wounds. And you done freed yourselves of your bonds. Who was the sorceress? Raven Air Shoes. Remember her name, Desperate? Yennefer. Conifer or some such. So, willing to help some old friends with you? But, wait, what, what, what she described? The hair color? Raven hair, it's so black. Right, okay. Because yeah. when he lost his memory, that's when he got together with Triss. Not, yeah, Triss. But they originally, he was originally with, with Yennefer. Right. That would, yeah, okay. All right. What kind of trouble are you in now? It's a matter of life. Death and quite a bit of coin in point of fact. New boy better night that he'll survive the assault in his shirt and knickers alone. We drunk a bit by then, I admit, but a wager's a wager. Our honor's at stake. A soldier's honor versus a knight's. I think I get it. The very core of the matter, Witcher. We're slated to go in the first wave, so the going's liable to be hard. New boy's brave, but he can't survive by courage alone. In any case, we come into this bauble that's supposed to protect him, magically like. You mind casting an expert's glance at it, seeing as sorcery and such is not strange to you. Let me see this bauble. Your wolf medallion, I saw it shake. 
It reacts to magic. So it's true, what the priest said. Hear that, new boy? You'll be safe. We'll fleece that night, we will. Where did you get this? Where did you get this talisman? We came by it, let's say. We were on patrol, see, and ran into a couple of novice priestesses, praying at this shrine. They were nice, smiling and all. We don't want to take them two on patrol. Ho ho ho! But... Shut it! Boat had one of his rare moments of clairvoyance, when rummaging in the shrine, found the amulet. Who knows what goes on in that head of his? But every now and then, he wakes up as good old Boholt. Aye, he still cuts them down with a single wallet. In any case, we took the amulet and went off to find the rest of the patrol. Oh, the wonders we saw. First, ran into some squirrels, vicious ones. Arrows flying everywhere, but we came through untouched. Barely three of the others still standing when a dragon swooped down, the elves fell to their knees, and we all legged it. The amulet's magic for certain. Though it failed to protect the shrine from your patrolling. Aye, true. Well, now we don't know what to think. I get the feeling that we're not on the good side. <laughs> what, of the war? You know, do, do you know like, it's like that, that peep show, uh, the, the skate, where it's like, are we the bad guys? <laughs> well, these guys are certainly assholes. There's clearly magic in the trinket, but I doubt it'll deflect swords or arrows. Shit, I knew it! I told you so, you idiot! Screw honor! Don your metal, new boy! You'll go into battle, confessional and all! So be it. Though I'd like to have fleeced the noble. Damn shame. Bye! Oh! Oh! <laughs> Oh, there's the infirmary. Oh, yeah. oh, 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 oh. Pick herbs. Hey. Just to make sure. Yep, okay. I know him. He's right. tough. He'll bounce back, you'll see, and kill many a lavalette. Care for a shot before you enter the siege tower? Or don't you drink and ride? <laughs> With full test to victory! Now, he's I'm very not... passionate for being surrounded by injured people. And, you know, he's drunk because he got a, like, a, a shiv in the side. It's the numb the, it's the, numb the pain. <laughs> That's a good point. Holy shit. <laughs> wow. That's amazing. We want you. We want you to serve in Fortress Army. Fucking didn't have enough objects. Get out of the way. Stop bothering me! Bloody hell. Good lad. Shut it. He's still alive. To disease, if that quack doesn't harm him. Ah, the aroma. Too old. Oh, I can cook. Look at him just eat his porridge. I'm too old for this, mate. You don't even have a grey beard. Okay. I'm too old for this. I better well be the lads that fell. Damn it! This is a field kitchen, not a bloody banquet. Your presence insults the gods. She'll turn yeah, away witch. from us in battle! Let's show Where is his pants? Put some pants on, buddy. Hey! Oh god, yeah. <laughs> crushed salamandra! Ah, the aroma. Told you I can cook! As long as I get the supplies. Mm. Be Where'd they get the meat the from? Dunno! Don't care. Might very well be the lads that fell yesterday. Hey! You're the one Oh, I turned the uh, fire on and off. Yeah. You can, yeah. Ah. You can use your ignis. Yeah, ig ignis or odd. Wait, is odd the uh, protective spell? Yeah. Cheer up, witcher. Or is it the pushing one? I think it's a protective spell. Laugh all you like. Come the assault, you'll be slipping on that shite. Better that than on my own entrails. Sound effect. The audio is all over the place. See if we find new boy dead, I will not be happy. He deserves to die. Running with those assholes. Voltus said if you don't order, he'll rip your balls off. And make a witch's medallion out of him. So my god, I'm going the right way. So that means we go the opposite way. 
Well, I feel like you've investigated most things. No, I mean, oh, oh, yeah, what was that about investigating most things? All right, all right, all right. <laughs> Your compass, not soldiers. Keep at it, and none of you will see home. Wow, that was an inspiration, and I have your compost not soldiers. And we're on the eve of battle, mate. Move those feet! This is the army, not the barnyard! On the double! Move it! Now! They're not even moving. Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of... Well... They're... They're... Method oh, oh. acting the compost. They're, me they're method acting... <laughs> Greetings. Can I interest you in a worthy cause? We could use what your support. What's the cause? Uh, a veterans fund for former fighting men of need. Uh huh. You gullible enough to fall for that? There's nothing to fall for. It's just some arm wrestling. Arm wrestling? Yeah, why? You put down some coin and we wrestle. Win and the pot is yours. Lose and. <laughs> well, the coin goes to the fund. Care to test your strength. Let's go, bitch. Oh gosh, how do I do this? Oh, that's coinage. We have two coins. We really have two coins too? Oh, okay. It's all or nothing, boys. Used. Whoa, 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 oh. Whoa, oh, whoa, oh, okay, 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 whoa, whoa, oh, 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 the fund grows. The veterans will be grateful. I'm not sure I read those instructions fast enough. I'm not even doing anything. Whoa, 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 back we go, back we go, back we go, back we go. Hubris, my friend. It's like that, uh, uh, Gone Good and Evil, where I think I'm gonna totally own the, uh, walrus dude, and he was like, nah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, shit, no, later. Bye. Bye. After a humiliate- oh, they're doing push-ups now. Today we enter the fray. Oh, Herb. Thank you. If it goes on like this, we'll be sipping wine in the lava lex chambers. You seek the king. He I think of that. I think we've adequately wasted enough time. Yep. <laughs> we got a die soon, otherwise these shots are for nothing. I know. Beautiful day for battle. Fear not, Excellency. We're out of range of their arbalists. I am so no much lighter than everything else. Yeah. I must admit, I prefer to joust verbally or with a pen, the emissary of peace that I am. Hogwash! You're the. You're Fuck. the. Finally! Traitors of the realm boil tar on the wall. What a fucking. Better. What a. What an outfit. We mount an assault today, and you'll be at my side. Follow me, gentlemen. Let's not keep the traitors waiting. That was close. That was Sire, very close. Said we were out of range. That was a ballista, Excellency. Its arms strengthened with bronze plates and strung with horsehair. It can propel heavy bolts up to a mile away. A deadly and very costly weapon. An experienced crew can cock and release two bolts each minute. Yet it has one flaw. Your Grace, please take cover. The recoil of the arms is so strong upon firing that the weapon shifts. It simply cannot hit the same spot twice. I had no idea your grace was a learned military engineer. I'm not. I gave the Baroness those ballistae two years ago for her birthday. Sire. And then she was like, no. <laughs> men who live in spite of such wounds. And what say you, your grace, of soldiers who inflict them? Those who did this live no more. Master Geralt, I wish to converse with you once the storm of battle has subsided. Forgive me, Excellency, but I plan to leave the royal court as soon as possible. Might I know why? Too often they take me for someone I'm not. What do they call you, soldier? Wait. 
You served with me at Brenner and during our foray into the Pontar Valley. Norman Sadel. Still an arbalist? Yes, sir. Fight has not been kind to me. Ha! Norman Sador, for your years of faithful service to the Crown, I appoint you Decurion of the Arbalists. Onwards, gentlemen. No reason to dawdle. Man, imagine living, like, as a military king. That would be... That would be weird. be pretty intense. Yeah. Decurion of the Arbalists warms the heart. At least and he seems to genuinely care about the people who are well, he, dying. Well, he seems. He seems. He seems. 